now for the image slider we have to add our dependency so go to the pubspec.html and open up your browser go to the famous pub.dev site and simply search for the dependency which is flutter underscore image underscore slider this one flutter image slider now click on installing and copy this flutter image slider and simply add that here and as you know that remove the version number so flutter image slider click pub get so it has been added successfully in our project and now come back to the user detail screen and let's implement this so you can say size box the height of this uh, image slider which we are going to implement it will be according to the screen height dot of context dot size dot height and whatever the screen height is take 0.4 percent of it and make sure to remove this const from the padding okay as you know that this image slider I mean this size box of course inside this size box we will implement that cursor or you can say image slider so this is a children widget of column and you know that column is a child of this padding so we have to remove the const from it as it is no longer a constant okay every phone has its own screen size okay it is changing according to the screen size the height okay that's why we remove the const so anyways the width will be whatever the width of the screen is it will be that then we can say child padding applying padding on the cursor and from all side to then we can say child cursor this one so we will add the indicated bar color the indicated bar color will be colors dot black dot with opacity 0 0.3 and the auto scroll duration how much we want so after every two seconds we want it to change to the next cursor image or if you want after three seconds then you can give here three is totally up to you and animation page duration that is the animation time when it changes after two seconds you see some animation as well so for that milliseconds 500 active indicated color will be color dot black and then the animation page curve will be curves dot here are different animation okay which animation you want to apply you can choose from it we will proceed with ease in then the indicated bar height we will set this to 30 this is the bar height now the indicator height the indicator height will be 10 and the indicator width will also be 10 and the unactivated indicated color will be color start gray which is basically a bar on which you will see round dots okay so the active will be uh, this one okay and the unindicated color will be this when we test the application you will see it stop at end false we want it to load continuously to repeat that is when it display the first image second image third fourth fifth image do you want to stop after fifth image the auto uh, scroll then if you want to stop it then you have to set it to true that is after the fifth image the cursor will stop that it will not keep loading the images that, that is you know move to the next image after two seconds it will load five images and then it will stop but if you want to repeat that is to make it in loop to start displaying the images from the start again then you have to set this to false 
that is you do not want it to stop at the end the auto scroll do you want so yes that is auto scroll simply means that after every two seconds it will automatically scroll to the next image okay and let's say if you do not want then you can simply uh, make this to false so the auto scroll will not be uh, allowed and the user has to uh, scroll by his fingers so it is totally up to you okay you will set it to true then the images finally so the images the first one we can display you can say you image dot network and our first image is URL image one and we will apply the property fit box fit dot cover and then simply copy paste it for the other ones for example then we have image URL two three four and five up to five images we will allow the user to upload and up to five images we are displaying here so now let's just test the application to see how it looks so the app is running now now let's go to the profile or you can say the user detail screen here you can see this is our slider as currently you already know that uh, we have uh, no images I mean the user who is currently logged in he has not yet uploaded the uh, images for the slider so that's why you see the profile editor in the all five images you can see URL image one two three four five okay which is auto scroll after every two seconds and you can see the bar indicator the active one has black color and the non active has gray colors okay you can see that so yeah this is all about our slider